Yeah, yeah, big storm coming, black rain coming, first in the world, tell me who won it, winning by 40, I ain't taking no knee, I'm running up scores, I'm throwing it deep, big storm coming, black rain coming, first in the world, tell me who won it, winning by 40, I ain't taking no knee, I'm running up scores, I'm throwing it deep, big storm coming, black rain coming, first in the world, tell me who won it, winning by 40, I ain't taking no knee, I'm running up scores, I'm throwing it deep, big storm coming, black rain coming, first in the world, tell me who won it, winning by 40, I ain't taking no knee, I'm running up scores, I'm throwing it deep. All right, man, so we're back at it. Um, um, what do I want to show you guys? Oh, I want to show you guys my team uh, before we jump into a game. Um, I know you guys seen uh, Ed Reed out there. And he's really the new, only like the new player that you guys haven't seen on my team. Um, but I'll just go through my team real quick for the guys who don't follow me. Uh, Joe Namath, um, High Rod Master, Gunslinger, Fearless, and Inside Dead Eye, I think. And like four out techs and a post up, I think. Pocket Dead Eye. Pocket Dead Eye Fillers, High Rod Master, Gunslinger. Um... Let's see, Deep Out Elite and Route Tech. Uh, Route Tech. Uh, Route Tech. Route Tech. Yeah, and I think somebody got a built in post up, I think. One of my guys got a built in post up. Um, defense. Now, the only thing that's changed about my defense is Ed Reed. And uh, he has film study for 2 AP. So, you guys don't see him right here. But I got Revis, Westry, um, Ty Law, Jalen Ramsey, Sneed, uh, Lawrence Taylor, inside stuff and edge threat. Uh, Khalil Mack, inside stuff, edge threat. Mean Joe Green, inside stuff. And these guys, you got acrobats and pick artists on them, my DBs. And um, Ed Reed has a uh, pick artist and film study right here and um <clears throat> i know i told you guys that film study is not that important in mutt and it's not but it's a mind game it's a mind game what i feel like like let's say i'm running a play and somebody know what i'm running you know so they can see my adjustments now when i got hot route master did i just go to season yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. When I when I got Hot Rod Master, I can draw up that same play. But what's different is it's gonna take me time to draw up that same play. While in Mutt, the play clock runs down faster. So let's say I want to run my crosser. You know what I'm saying? I want to run PA uh, cross, and I can run that. I can I got Hot Rod Master, so I can really draw that up whenever I want. But it's the fact of, because there's no other play in that trips tight end that has that crosser as a stock play. So I'd have to run, I'd have to switch my play to another passing play. And then I'll have to draw up my crosser in the same route combination. Which is going to take me a little longer to do, you know what I'm saying? Um, then if I just come out my straight crosser play, you know what I'm saying? So um, film study is like a mind game and then I got it now. So like some people don't even understand what film study is. So... I'm sitting there looking at their play and all their passing routes and combinations they're doing, and they're still doing it. And they don't even know that I can see what they're doing. You know what I'm saying? Um, but the good players, what they'll do, they're just audible to the same formation. They're just audible to a different pass. And with Hot Rod Master, they just draw up whatever play they're really trying to run. You know what I'm saying? So um, film study does that. And with your audibles, you got to have a different pass play as your audible to do it. You know what I'm saying? Because if you run that same play, that same base play, any route combination you do, I can see all your adjustments. You know what I'm saying? So, I kind of like film study. For 2 AP, I'll definitely take it. Because I think it's 5 AP uh, originally. So, for 2 AP, I'll definitely take it. Um, but let's talk about it, man. Last uh, video, I beat Foop. And he had some messages for me, man. He had some messages for me. And I'm impressed. Because 
Foop has two accounts. He plays 50 games every single weekend. You know what I'm saying? So he said, how the hell do your players play like that on D? And on O, how is that corner out beating shaded underneath man? I don't even think he had my corner route manned up. And on O, how is that corner route beating shaded underneath man? I don't even think he had my corner route manned up. I really don't. He said, that's crazy. Never seen that before. I said, play like what on D? He said, I never lose to man, but your man pre but your man pressed me into the ground and I can't get any separation. So it's just a mix up of playing over top coverage, underneath coverage. It's a mix up of uh putting your zone drops at 510. Uh, putting your putting your the right zones out there with man, you know what I'm saying? There's always gonna be a body on a body, and people be like, "Yo, you run a man to man? That's simple. It's not simple." Ooh, sweet kitten. I haven't played him in a while. I'm playing nothing but demons this weekend, and it's because I'm playing majority of my games on Sundays. But um, man to man is putting a body on a body, and um. Putting some zones out there to stop certain routes that you think your opponent's gonna run. Now I heard that sweet kitten uh, is glitching people. I heard he's. I think I heard he's glitching people. So I'm really. Let me ask the group chat: Is sweet kitten glitching people? Because I heard he is. So I just don't want to get glitched, honestly. All right. So, but if y'all know sweet kitten, he usually runs this fucking. Blitz, man. But Steve McNair, uh, two superstar running backs. So he might be a runner now. I don't know. Um, three, four, nine, nine speed receivers, two ninety eight speed tight ends, and all ninety nine DBs and safeties. Um, but they say he be glitching, so I don't really know. Gun bunch tight end. What he usually like to do on defense is use a rush. He's going to hike the ball. I mean, he's going to take his user and just run around your whole damn defense and sack the ever-living shit out of you. So, we just got to see about that. Look like he's a runner. Oh, oh, good question. A good question. Do he have playmaker? Because for some reason, I feel like he got to have somebody out there with playmaker. Gunslinger, Hot Rock Master. He got his post open for a touchdown. And he caught it. Wow. Didn't expect him to catch that. But um, this is an easy, easy, this is easy to stop. I just got out of position early. Um, I didn't set my zone drops and whatnot. So um, we're not really too concerned with this. Not really too concerned with this corner route. Ooh. Do that? Case we kitten? Thank you. Oh, my God. They cheated me. They fucking cheated me, dog. They cheated me. I put a hook right there on five. They cheated me. That's crazy. They cheated me like that, dog. That's crazy they cheated me like that, dog. That's crazy. Goal line from the goal line. Um goal line. Goal line, really. Good hit stick. Goal line. That's crazy, dog. It's crazy. Like what the f what what more? What more do I Madden? Talk to me, man. Madden, talk to me. It's fucking defense, Madden. Talk to me. You don't want me to pick the ball off, man? What's up? Seriously. Blitz the damn shit out you, bro. I blitz the damn shit out of you. But fuck, man. Y'all gonna... Like, 
<laughs> is that what we doing? But what he like to run is man to man. We're not even, yeah, man to man, couple zones. And he'll bring a dude off the edge and whoop and sack the shit out of you in 0 0.2 seconds. I wonder if he's still doing it. Look like he is. Yep. So what I'll be doing is I will be under center. I, my friends, will be under center this whole game, pretty much. Actually, actually, I remember what I did to him last time. Actually, what I did is I put in a tight end right here. And I just started motioning down. That's what I did. That's what I did. I just started motioning down and running the ball. I remember now. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Ooh, I mean, kind of like that, but when, this just lets me know. This is just good for me because he's not gonna. He's not gonna blitz off the edge. You know what I'm saying? Now he got a for real play coverage. And. I like it. I got X. I'm throwing it to X. The dig. Um. I gotta go for it. I have to. He'll block my. He'll block my punt. I think. Let me see if he's gonna line up and set up to block my punt. If he is, then we don't. We can't punt the ball. Nope. Not trying to. Oh, he might be trying to block it. I thought he wasn't gonna try to, but now that I look at it, he might actually be trying to block it. Yep. So I slide that guy down to the edge right there. We not going for that. Nope. We'll just go for it, bro. It ain't that. It ain't that serious. It ain't that serious. I really don't know what I want to do, honestly. Can't punt the ball. Can't. I mean, that's his defense. Just run around your whole. Just run around your whole shit. Corner routes wide open. Ran my guys over. Oh, man. Oh, that sucks. Of course, my hook's not going to play that. Even though I got a fucking hook. I... Of course, my hook doesn't play that. Of course, it doesn't. We got to get in single back deuce close, man. Um... Just got to get in single back deuce close. At least out of this, I can pass the ball. If he got deep out of leaps on his guys, we are in trouble. If his guys got deep out of leaps, I mean, deep route KO on them, it is over with. Um, let me see. Deep route KOs, yeah, <laughs> and short route KOs, and mid route, yeah, just yeah. He know what he's doing. That's smart. That's smart. That is that is that is smart. I like that's smart. I'm actually trying to watch his basketball game and play at the same time. It's just not smart of me. First of all, he's gonna blitz the shit out of me. That was the that was the floppiest ball I've ever seen. Are my guys tired? Quarterback's a little tired, but that was like the slowest ball I've ever seen. And like I was saying earlier, like you don't really have time to really do what you want to do. Um, one once you got an audible and shit, I really ain't got time to really. I mean, now I'm having time, but. Great ball, great read. I need to lock in. I need. I really need to turn this damn basketball game off and really lock in on this. Yeah, let me let me turn this off real quick. Let me lock in. And it's like my guys can't block two of his guys. That's the. That's really the only. Pro that's like really the only problem, honestly. 
Like, he's dropping. This shit's about to give me a headache. It's not like that he's playing great defense, which he is. But it's also the fact that that he's dropping eight guys. He's dropping eight guys in coverage, and two people was getting home. And then he just used a rush to me while he's rushing just three people. Hmm. So he's rushing three people, right? Hear me out. He's rushing three people, dropping eight in coverage, and I have not even a second to pass the ball. Great defense. Oh, I thought we caught that. Great defense. Yeah, it ain't just, it's just not much I can do right now. It's just, and I've beaten this dude before, too. Just not much I can muster up and do right now. What a laser. What a. And it's not that his offense is good. His offense actually suck. But his, his defense allows him to really do what he want to do on offense. And once you get out of. Once you get out of your rhythm, it's over with. All right, yeah, I'm about to, yeah, that's it for me. I ain't about to, yeah, this shit's crazy. Because he, that's not, a, that's not a normal read. That's like, he, the only reason he threw that is because he know that I can't, there ain't shit I can do in offense right now. So, he can do, he can do that. He can throw that, you know what I'm saying? He can be as risky as he want now. There ain't shit I can do in offense. There ain't, there ain't shit I can do on offense, so. I'm just stuck between a rock and a hard place right now. And I know y'all are probably tell me, yo, Ren, you got to run the ball. There ain't much running the ball. I mean. um, He got deep route KOs. Yeah, this shit's tough. Deep route KOs, mid zone KOs. He got a lot of shit going on out there. That's terrible. That is a bad read. That is a terrible read. Terrible. But what's crazy is he got... <laughs> He don't have no acrobats, no pick artists, just mid zone KO, deep route KO. Like he KO and all that shit. He is KO and all that shit. There's no way, bro. There's no way. And y'all see what he's running? He's running the stock play, no adjustments to it. No, not one adjustment to it. Just hiking it. Now he finally did an adjustment for him. Now he's finally doing adjustments. And I got a, I got a, I have a yellow right there. I have a yellow. Thank you, bro. Like, come on now. He just, I, I honestly, like, he, he's he's good because the defense he run is good. His offense is not good. And it's, it sucks to say that. Like, it, it really do suck to say that because, like, and I won't even say, like, I'm just trying to use my words carefully because, like, I don't want to say he suck, but, like, I just don't understand it. He rushes. He, he drops eight people in coverage. Use a rush for one guy. And since he's dropping eight in coverage, you don't really have nowhere quick to throw it because you got to throw it quick. You got to throw it quick because he's going to just run around and sack. I just can't remember. I just can't remember what I did last time we played. 
excuse me, last time we played. It's one of these guys like you should write down, you should write this shit down in a notebook so whenever you run into it and you see it, because you re it's rare you're gonna see it. But this is one of them guys you gotta like. Once you see it, you gotta remember what you used to do. Because once you, you feel me. And, and you see, I can't run the ball. I can't. I just can't remember what I was doing last time. Hike the ball. I think Luke said he just quick hike. He just quick hikes him. I think that's what Luke said. He he just does. You just gotta quick hike him and make a quick ass read before he come around the edge. I really do think that's that's what you gotta do. Now he's not blitzing, and this is just this is great. Um. He literally blitzed. He just fucking blitzed nobody but what but himself. He blitzed nobody but himself. I don't know. That's crazy. It's almost like I can hike the ball and just step up in the pocket and just scramble. While I'm throwing it to B, who's wide open. Wide open. Shit's crazy. And now he's about to just do what he want to do on defense now. I mean, on offense now. Because he, he he's in control of the game. He can just... He can make risky reads. He can do whatever he want to do now. Come on, bro. I'm, I'm about to quit. I'm about to quit. Like, I'm, I'm for real about to quit. Like, <laughs> that's a pick six. That is a pick six. Thank you. But, I mean, it really doesn't. That's a punt, pretty much. That's a punt. His offense is not good. It's just it just the the whack ass defense, bro. He just really just rushed, rushed one person, one person. I don't know how to explain it, bro. Good catch. He rushed one person, bro. He he rushed himself and ran around my whole damn. He ran around my whole damn team. The shit's the shit just nonsense. It really don't make I think you gotta have escape artists. I think what I need is escape artists. And and what's even crazier, like now he can put his zone drops on five and zero and just stop all the little short shit that I'm doing. If he just put his zone drops on five and zero, if he put his zone drops on five and zero with all these zones out there with deep route KO, you're not gonna throw the ball deep on him. So it's like, and what, bro? That, that, this is this is just just crazy. This shit is just crazy. <laughs> it's a it's a good strategy though. It's a great strategy. Great defense. Great defense. There's nobody more frustrating to play than Sweet Kitten and then sometimes Mr. Foop. There's nobody more frustrating to play. Just block the man. It's two. 
It's oh my god, just block. It's yeah, I'm about to quit. Yeah, don't worry about it, bro. I'ma quit. GG, bro. GG. GG. You got that one right there. You got that one. I'll honestly probably get some hate mail from him. I know for a fact he might send some hate mail. Um We've we've played before. And I'm pretty sure he sent some hate mail. Nope, looking at it right now, he never sent no hate mail, he just sent GG's uh back in January. No hate mail, but I think he was beating me like 45 to 0 or some shit. I think the first time we played, we were like 45 to 0, and he sent GG's after. That's why I thought he sent some hate mail. But yeah, man, um, I just can't, you just, once you get down on somebody like that, there really ain't too much you can, you can do. Um, let's see how many he won last week. Let's see how many he won last week. Um, damn, not even. He might have didn't even play last week, cause there's no way he wouldn't be. Yeah, there's no way he played last week, cause there's no way he wouldn't be up way up there somewhere, 24, 25 wins. And that was the first time I've ran into him in a little minute too, so. Yeah, he he must just be getting back on and getting back into it, cause that shit's crazy. Hey, Black Rain, oh, yeah, oh. Alright, let's do this. For daily sticky uploads, follow me at YT Black Rain 4 on TikTok. For hoodies and t-shirts, click the link down below in the description. Black Rain's bin. That's where you get all your gear at. For funny stories and motivational stories, follow me on Snapchat at Black Rain 4. And for the latest news on everything, follow me on Instagram at Black Rain 4. And last but not least, if you want to play anybody in Rain Gang, look down below in the description. All the information is down there that you need. You dig? You dig, you dig, you dig.